Today I'm going to show you a quad lift, quad rotation sequence. Now before you do this sequence, if you haven't already, I want you to go back and watch my individual exercises on my individual videos. I have one on quad lifts and I have one on quad rotations. So pause this video, go back and watch those, Now, and then come back here and I'm going to show you how to put those two exercises into a really awesome sequence because you're going to notice an immediate improvement in the strength of your hip. So what you're going to do is you're first going to start off with the quad lifts. So you're going to come back against the wall just like I showed you in that first video. Be sure to go back to those individual videos for the full instructions. You're going to go through 10 reps on one side, keeping the arch in your low back. And then you're going to go through 10 reps on the other side. Again, keeping the arch in the low back and it's going to feel really hard. It's going to feel challenging to lift your leg off the floor. Now I've been practicing these a lot, so I might be making it easy, but don't let this fool you. So after you do one set of 10 on each leg, you're going to get your block and you're going to go through three sets of 10 rotations on each side. So take your time on these ones. Don't just go through the motions. Really hold that arch in your low back. So you're going to do 10 on the right leg, 10 on the left leg. Breathe. Keep your stomach relaxed. And then continue to switch and work through three sets of 10 on both legs. Now you're going to come back to your quad lifts. Same position here, hips touching the wall. Place an arch in your low back and you're going to notice a difference. You're going to notice an improvement in your strength. It's actually pretty cool. So finally, to finish off here, you're going to do three sets of 10. So 10 on the right, 10 on the left, and again, rotating through three sets of 10. Now this is really demanding and really challenging to do those full sets and reps. So I want you to start off with what you can work up to it. You're going to see some great improvements in your hip strength. If you have any questions, let me know and I'll see you next time.